welcome back to my channel. I am Simply Brentley. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. For all of your manifestation needs as well as for personals, head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. Holy Father, angels, ancestors, speak through me. If I reach one person and one person alone, which I know I will, please and thank you. All right, all right, all right. Let's go ahead and ground for the collective, darling. This is the energy. It's like, I'm, I'm just like, I'm shaking in my boots for some good news. It's like transformational energy is everything, y'all. And, and the song that I have right now is, um, what God has for me, it is for me. What God has for me, it is for me. I know without a doubt that he will bring me out. What God has for me, it is for me. Okay, yes, 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 yes. Cut the deck on right on three of discs. You're celebrating. It's going to be a celebration. Celebrating and celebrating. Celebrate. It's a celebration, good time, okay? So I definitely, and look at all the growth. Oh my goodness. Look at all the growth. You are made out of freaking, like the outfits are made out of freaking grass. You are growing. You, like anywhere you go, anywhere you move, you're constantly growing. You are connected to the divine. Yes, okay. Ace of disc, okay. Something you have been manifesting. You are gonna get some type of financial gain. And then what do we have? The empress, the empress. We have the Empress. You are very beautiful inside and out. And like, um, I feel like you may have been doubting yourself in a certain situation, person, place, whatever. Um, but what it is, is growth all around you. You have everything. You have everything that you need. And, and anything that's going to be for you is always going to... I'm getting that strong healing energy that you have. But I'm also getting that some doubt here. And that's that strong song in my spirit, what, spirit, what God had has for me, it is for me. That is definitely for you. Anything that is meant for you is going to always be for you. Make sure, I don't know why Spirit just called me to this piece of obsidian. If you need um, to get some obsidian research that, that is um, something that transmute the negative energy. So it takes it. You may have some negative energy. It doesn't matter. It takes it back. It transmutes it and it sends it back. Okay? It, and let's go ahead and with the Ace of Cups, you have a lot of love. You have a lot of love within you. You are a very loving person. You are a person that, that lives through your heart. Look, your cup runneth over. And your cup is about to run over with a lot of blessings. You are going to get some blessings just drop out of the sky. And it feels like it's from nowhere, but it's really not from nowhere because you've been working hard on yourself. Strength. Okay, cut the that. Look at all these major, major arcanas. Strength. We have strength here because you had some type of inner demons. And look, you, you honed in on that shit. You understood the power of having that masculine and feminine energy balance. You are, look at that steam coming off of you. Look at that steam. It is definitely like you are divinely guided in anything that you do. You, you know like um, that you can have a big ego at times, but you know how to subdue that shit. You know how to subdue any inner demons. And you understand the power of having your strength because you've been through some tough shit. You've been through some tough obstacles. The chosen ones often are, right? We're going, we're going through tough shit, but it's okay because we have the strength to be able to overcome. Even in points and times in our life where we feel like, damn, how much more can I take? Damn, I'm feeling down. I'm feeling out. Um, it's always some shit on me. And you know how they always say, how he's, he's not going to put more on you than you can bear. And sometimes it feels like that, right? And this is reminding me of a reading that I did, a personal. Um, sometimes it definitely feels like that shit, but best believe you have the strength to go ahead and overcome that. I'm definitely getting the energy of this for you. I'm definitely getting the energy. Okay, pen uh, two of uh, this, two of pentacles. It's definitely balancing. You you um, understand how to prioritize, right? Your time management skills is on motherfucking point. And with that masculine, it don't matter backwards, forward, sideways. You're still balancing that shit. You're still balancing that shit and you're doing a damn good job. You're doing a damn good job. And it's like you're almost to the end. Here here, here you are with this constant infinity symbol right here. Um, here you are with that infinity symbol. You have that constant growth. You understand that it's about constantly prioritizing. You understand that it's about constantly having those time management skills and having to be able to like, you have a lot of shit that you be having to do. 
You be having a lot of shit that you be having to do, but you understand the having to prioritize it all. The high priestess. That's what fell on the floor. The high priestess. You understand following your intuition. Look at your third eye. Your third eye is on motherfucking point. You are very beautiful. Um, I do see um something just with wisdom, something with gaining wisdom, something with um you may have found out some information that was hidden. Um, I but I do see that you are the light. You are the light. You're following your intuition. You're very abundant. You're very beautiful inside and out. And you know, that cannot be duplicated. You are beautiful absolutely inside and out. And then we have the sun, the moon, the stars, the mountain. I give you the world. I, I really feel like, um, uh, you know, this is coming in for you. This is, And then we have the infinity. It's going to be a continuous high. A magician right here. We see that infinity symbol depicted right there. It's going to be some type of, there was some type of difficult choice that had to be um, made with the two of swords, but it's balancing out. You you are very multifaceted. There's so many different levels to it. It's levels to this shit. <laughs> and, and then we have the magician. We have the magician. So you are very much so a powerful manifester. And this is continuous. This is continuous. And look at all the planets around you. You have very much so magical energy. You have very much so the energy of um, the energy of master manifester, the energy of master manifester, being able to understand, um, that you have everything within you, right? You have everything within you and it's continuous and you're continuously growing and you're continuously manifest, mess, manifesting. And anybody seven of swords that had any deceitful things, anybody that, that had tried to get some type of wherewithal where they were trying to be deceitful, trying to be clever, trying to, um, trying to do some shit that was not, um, it's all about. Their intentions was not well. Their intentions was not well. They were just trying to get some shit out of it. And you're moving away from that shit. Okay, cut the deck right on Ten of Swords. Anybody that stabbed you in the back, it felt like you couldn't pick yourself up, but you were able to pick yourself up from, like, you felt like it was some of the lower point, the lowest points. You picked that shit up. You picked yourself up, and you were able to continue with that shit. Because with the Ten of Swords, it's like feeling like you're almost damn near dead because shit always keeps on happening. But realizing that you're not and you have the strength, what strength came out earlier to go ahead and, you know, overcome any of those obstacles that you may be facing. And renewal is here. We have judgment. We have rebirth. We have um, another chance. You have renewal here. You have a new life. You have this earth angel energy. Yes. And then um, two of cups. And I really feel like this two of cups is with the divine. You are having a power within yourself of having that feminine and that masculine energy and you're toasted. You're, you're very abundant and, and you have, like, look at this, look how this um, lotus is. The lotus. Very muggy, very, like, it comes out beautiful. Very beautiful. It doesn't matter, like, no matter um, what hardship you've gone through, whatever mucky waters that you had to grow in, a grow through, you you got in your I don't give a fuck energy. I don't give a fuck energy and I'm going to just continue to grow within myself. I'm going to continue to learn and always know that it's about constantly growing because if you're not constantly growing, what the fuck are you doing, period? It's all about constant growth. We can't be in the same place that we was last year or the year before. Look back and you know you're not. You know that you have learned some things. You know that you have completed some karmic cycles and you know that growth is within you and you're constantly growing and learning every single day. You're changing your conscious mind. You're understanding that any of these um, these aspects of your life that may feel negative, that may feel like um, things that you, you can't, you know that shit is not yours. You know that shit, shit is not yours to bear and that's some shit that somebody else tried to put on you and you're waking up, right? You're waking up from this matrix and you're understanding what's really real out here. What's really real? All right. And, let's, uh, and look, look what it is, the star constant growth, constantly, as you fill up that cup, you're giving it. As you fill the cup, you're giving it. And you're confident enough to go out here, start naked, and understand that whatever you need is constantly growing. You don't need anything. Your confidence is very beautiful. You are very beautiful, and it's within you from the outside in. You're beautiful, period. You're beautiful. You're genuine. You're loving. And that unconditional love that you constantly show, you're getting that shit. That law of attraction, you're getting that shit. You're celebrating. And, and this abundance is right here for you. You just have to lean into yourself and continue to show yourself that self-love. It all begins from within. All right, all right, all right. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. For all of your manifestation needs as well as the personals, head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. As always, peace, love, and namaste.